Welcome back to For Fossils Sake, as we travel across Taranaki, New Zealand, on our hunt for ancient and extinct fossils. As we enter the valley, we are blown away by the beauty and the serenity. We are on private property today, with permission of course granted by the landowner, who wants us to date the rocks on his land. We are going deep into the Miocene today, folks. A remarkable epoch spanning about 23 to 5 million years ago. The Miocene is renowned for its rich fossil record. Taranaki is prevalent in the Miocene, largely due to a series of submarine volcanoes that erupted during mid to late Miocene. Now keep watching, as we are about to reveal some epic Miocene finds. Now we hit the valley. Let's see what we find today. Yeah. A bit of calcite like, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, it's not nothing. We're looking for that. Cool. We have a find. We have Woo! a find. Yeah. Oh, oh. Nice. I don't know what they look like. What have you found? Got a little actino to Carson's here. Mm. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wait. See it? Somebody's starting to lick things on the side of it. You don't do that. Oh. <sighs> that came out of that. See that? Mm. Eggs and eggs, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. Inside, oh, that sounds a nodgy. So, I haven't opened it yet. Okay. Oh, well, hey. Whoa. Hey. Don't know. What is that, Kia? That would be. That looks crab to me. Yeah. Looks like a claw. Whoa, cool. Yeah. That was that was the one I found right at the start. And he's bashing it for ages. Yeah. Look at the spikes on that. Do you know what it is? It's, it looks like a pie crust claw, bro. Cool. 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 Yeah. yeah. No, there is stuff in those ones. The smaller one's just a little bit easier. Nice find. Nice. Hmm. Is that a mussel or a Yeah. What did you find? Uh, Corey found this one. It's a shell. Look at this double shell. It's called a bivalve. Cool. Leptomythrax. You're a tea. Oh. Nova, move away from Kia. Don't, don't look. Jack just found a whole pie crust ball. Kimball's going to get it. Which one are you looking at? Mm. Hey? Right. So I have an egg. Three. Yeah, maybe I'm blind. I don't see it. It's about the same height of her up. Oh, that one there is sticking off. Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah, those, so that's gorse. So go the other way, maybe. Oh, no, have you got a little, that little crab that you found today? Find! Give him a minute. We'll go down. I don't know if it's a claw. Oh, cool. Yeah. Just finish eating up with it and then we'll sort of Does it work? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, no, it's very cool, eh? <laughs> There's a bit more in here. It's it's really cute. Cute. What? But what? But, but what? 
Run away, run away. Potentially. I don't know. I know. It's, I brought. I actually brought vinegar last time. I was unprepared today. Might go in. Oh no! Nothing. <laughs> Found. Whoa. Can you put that back in there somehow, Dad? Jeez, Roy, you're taking half the race. Oh. Just like, just like that. Mm. And then this one here, like this. Wow, look at this claw. Okay, check out this claw. This would tell go. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's pretty cool, eh? That's a wicked little claw. Yeah. Gorgeous. Oh, <laughs> and we've got a black stuff. We've got a shells. bunch of shells. Shells. Oh. That's all black. It's yeah. unfortunate, Dad, because um It was a good egg. Well, a little um gastropods. Mm, yeah, you're finding all of them. <laughs> what is that? Oh it's my a God, crab. What is it? Oh, it's, it's a, it's a hermit crab. No, is it a what the fuck? Oh I know what they are. Are they barnacles? These are barnacles. These are barnacles on top of this. Can you see the barnacle? Oh yeah, it is too. See? Oh yeah. They pick Crazy. barnacles on top of this shell. That's actually very cool. Look at the barnacles. Another gastropod. <laughs> look at the. Um, That's a cool gastropod. Sorry, look at the quality on the on the. <laughs> on the um, yeah, barnacles. Well preserved. Another paper in here somewhere. Name. Is that the right shell? Yeah, yeah, it's just you gotta find the right way to right, go. Right, 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 right. So it goes back in. Wow. Come on, Barbie. Let's go, Barbie. This valley would have been a part of the ocean floor during the Miocene the period. Terrain. During the Miocene, New Zealand was a lush, subtropical archipelago teeming with life. As mentioned, this period is renowned for its rich fossil record, revealing a diverse array of thriving flora and fauna. Among some of the incredible fossils unearthed, right, we are Dad? finding evidence of ancient marine life, including giant penguins, ancient dolphins so and early sharks. The Miocene was also home Goats. to the largest seabird ever discovered, the Pelagornis. A giant seabird with a wingspan that twice that of an albatross it once ruled our skies. The fossils found of Miocene marine life give us a clear and visual image of life in our ocean past. A land dominated by dense forests and nutrient-rich oceans with larger-than-life creatures. Let us not forget the crabs, which are quickly starting to make a name for themselves in Taranaki, New Zealand. The Leptomythrax and Actinotocarcinus are the two rare and extinct species of crabs that we've been finding. The Leptomythrax have 15 go. known species go. within the whole Western ah. Pacific, and six of those have been found solely in New Zealand. Super special. Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? And of course, not to forget the latest species of crab to be described from these waters, the Pseudocarcinus cull Robohymerae. Found not goat? too far from this valley, actually, oh, showing off its monstrous claws and epic evolutionary Where's history. Oh, God. Fossils Yay, not only Anna. showcase the vibrant ecosystem of the Miocene, but help us to understand the evolutionary journey of New Zealand's unique wildlife. Stick around to the end to see some beautiful displays of Miocene fossils found today. And please don't forget to like and subscribe to For Fossils Sake. It means so much to our little family. 
and inspires us to go further and take more adventures, all for the sake of fossils. <laughs>